who could teach me to pick locks? What reason do you have for staring at me? Well, you're not a member of the Inquisition, and you don't look like a fighter. I'm not. I'm a treasure seeker. Ruins searched, tombs emptied, valuables recovered, pockets lined. When I'm not being held prisoner, that is. What did you do to get locked up? The Inquisition wanted me and my brothers to work for them. We're independent operators. Picking sides is bad for business. Then they got wind we'd dug up these three golden bowls. And they want them. They're obsessed with artifacts. They can lock me up for as long as they like, but I'm not telling them a thing about those bowls unless they pay me a decent price. How much do you want for these golden bowls? Want to join the queue, do you? Well, at least you're talking price. That's more than they are. Give me 200 gold and I'll tell you where I hid mine. Deal? You're a treasure seeker. Any good? My brothers and I are the best. You're one of the triplets. You always work together. Three heads are better than one. And three sets of arms when it comes to shoveling. We know our craft. Not like the amateurs they filled the ruins with now. We came a long way to end up on this island, and now we're stuck here. Who do you triplets work for? We're free agents. We work for whoever pays the most. Pay us, we'll deliver. Treasure seeking is just digging, isn't it? You think? There's skill to it. That's why we're paid, skill and danger. We've sailed the most dangerous seas and gone where fighters fear to tread. What kind of job are you looking for? We're not fussy. At least not while we're stuck here, we're not. If you have a job for us, then don't stay silent. Although, you'll have to help us get out of town first. I definitely can't help you if I'm locked up. You need me? You'll have to convince Hernandez to let me go. Can you teach me anything? I can show you how to prospect for ore with a pickaxe. I thought you were a treasure seeker. Hacking into a hidden wall or prospecting for ore, it's all the same. Only ore is much less interesting than treasure. Show me how to prospect. Show me how to prospect. First, you have to be able to tell where ore can be found. You can't just go swinging at any old rock. How do I recognize ore deposits? The stone glitters, and the structure of the rock is different. Often you can see ore bubbles. They hang on the rock like pimples. When you find a good rock, take the pick in both hands and swing straight. That's very important. The point has to hit the deposit square on, or the rock will splinter, then it's worthless. Don't expect to be as good as I am from the off. It takes practice. But put in the time and you can make decent coin from prospecting. How do I convince Hernandez to let you go? Well, you know why they're holding me. They want the three bowls. So? Get those three bowls out of circulation. I'm suddenly less interesting. Find them. Make them disappear. How can I take these bowls out of circulation? Well, if you can get your hands on them, you can sell them to someone who can get them out of town. What if the Inquisition get to them first? Then it's up to you to handle it. The bowls just need to vanish from town. Look, just tell me where this golden bowl is hidden, or you'll rot here. That knowledge is valuable. No payment, no information. I thought you wanted out of here. I'm not gonna sell myself short to get out. 
No point in being free without a future, is there? I'll get you out of town. You sound like you take pride in your work. I like that. Well, if you're up for it, you'll have to deal with the guard at the entrance. I doubt I'll get out of here unless you can persuade Hernandez to free me. Shouldn't your brothers know what we're planning? Yes. Tell them to come to our meeting point. They'll know where I mean. Okay, I'll tell them to go there. Great. I bet they're drinking themselves into a stupor in the Gutter's Tavern or on the Harbor Quay. Here's the gold. Now tell me where you hid the bowl. I knew the Inquisition had been watching me, so I lost them. Hid the bowl in the Harbor Lighthouse. Threw it up into the wooden beams. Going to be difficult getting it back without a telekinesis spell. Of course. That's your problem now. This text is about magic spells. Now who could teach me to pick locks? Here, this seems to be the Don's amulet. Well, would you look at that? And the boys said they'd gone through everything. Right. I'll take it from here. Have a few gold coins for your trouble. And tell Tony his prize has been snatched from under his nose. Maybe he'll stop his skulking about. I found Don Esteban's amulet. You did? Where is it? Hernandez has it. You what? What happened? How did he even know it was there? You realize I've got to tell a Don. You've dropped me into a world of shit. Oi! You there! Go to the guardhouse. Carlos wants to talk to you. Not now. Let's trade. Thank you. 
Here's your gold. All right. I bet Luca still pockets enough for himself. Here are the plates. If you're asking for a fight, you can have one. Others have tried. All right then, you bastard. Again! Ah! Gold for me. Your brother, Ulf, wants you to go to your meeting point. Thanks. I'm on my way. Had enough? Let's try again. If you say so. All right then, you bastard. Use that damn weapon. Uh. You show them. Uh. That took skill. Uh. Uh. You show them. Yeah. Uh. You show them. Uh. Uh. That took skill. You show them. You show them. Use that damn weapon. Ah! Now it's good. Yeah! Again! Ah! More gold for me. Had enough? Let's try again. If you say so. All right then, you bastard. Come on! Ah! Ugh. Come on! Ugh. I like it. I like it. Ah! Ah! Getting up anytime soon. Ow. Useful work there. Will you give me the armor plates now, or does this have to get messy again? No, no. I've had enough. Here they are. I hope someone stabs you right through those damn plates.
I have Vasily's armor. Right. Give me the 50 gold pieces and we'll leave it at that. From now on, though, stick to your agreements with Luca. Yeah, if only for the quiet life. Your wife is worried about your sons. Oh, Tilda. She worries about everything. No wonder my lads have gone. They needed the peace. I'll pay you for the armor plate. Have it. I need the gold. To spend on drink? It's better than giving it to the wife, nagging old shrew. Tilda. You know what that's short for, don't you? Till dawn, till dusk. Because that's how long she nags me. I could just take the armor. Ho-ho! You think I'm just a drunk? I defended my farm against the monsters, and I'll defend this against you. You fancy your chances, then? If I have to. This is going to end in a fight. You're worse than my wife. You have to be careful. Put that thing away. Now that's better. What do you want? You've got what you wanted. Now leave me alone. But nothing changes. It's always the same, that guy. Should not have stolen. That's murder. Leave. You should go away. Ericsson had this key on him. It belonged to Captain Gregorius. Ericsson, the miserable pox rash. He must have stolen it off one of those disease-ridden whores. He better pray they gave him something that'll kill him before I do. Tell someone who cares. Did you want something?
<sighs> right, do your worst. You want to fight? Go on, give him one. Yeah. Uh, uh, don't bail uh, too soon. Uh, Keep it up. Uh, uh, hit him hard. Uh, Keep it up. Uh, 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 Keep it up. Hand over the armor. Take it. I've had enough. Take it. Oh, I need a drink. Not that I can afford it. All right, I'll buy your armor plates. Well, I don't have them on me. Behind the warehouse, up the stairs, is a room. Plates are in a seaman's chest in there. Here's the key. Please don't disturb me. Here, I found the three golden bowls. I'm impressed. Nimble work getting to them before they got to Esteban's rabble. I'll let Commandant Carlos know of your success. Thanks to you, I didn't have to get violent. That's behind me now. Now then, about a reward. I thought that might be on your mind. Very well. You have a choice. I'd like the gold. Very well. I retrieved the five armor plates. Luca was after them, but he was unlucky. Good work. If only you had a little more faith and a little less profit in that brain of yours. Maybe you're the person to convince Luca to get out of town. I'd do it myself, but that man sends my mind to a dark place. Now then, about a reward. I thought that might be on your mind. Very well. You have a choice. I'll go for the mana potions. All yours. I'll talk to Luca. Good. I'm sure you'll make him see the error of his ways. Consider it done. I'll collect my reward later. I gave the armor plates to Carrasco. So, you're with the Inquisition, are you? Why are you here? You come to finish me off for your new best friend? I think it would be best if you disappeared. And if I don't? Oh, forget that. I can see from your face what would happen. Okay, I'll make with a vanishing act. Could it be dangerous to us? I think you should have put up more of it. What 
did you do? Come on, out with it. Out with what? My city's left town, and I'm sure it's your fault. Siddy makes his own decisions. Just get out of my sight, you bastard. Yes? Never been the same since, has he? Not for a day. She was worth every penny. Holf sent me. You're supposed to rendezvous at the meeting point. Great. So, he's okay. Thanks for the message. I'll see you around. Oh, crap. What do you want? I thought I'd lost you. Then you need to work on making your secret meetings a little more secret. Oh, crap. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Yeah. I seen you about. Nosing in everyone's business. People don't like people's noses being stuck into other people's business. People like that get hit by people. Hand over the packages you took. Sure you want to do this? Absolutely. Then you leave me no choice. Garth, get him! Shut his flapping mouth. Time for a little lesson. Huh? Yes. Some good moves there. I could do with that gold. Don't touch anything. Haven't you got nothing better to do? Not right now. Please don't disturb me. Put your weapon on. Oh, Keep running! Him. I get so why I th and if I oh. Don wants this, the Inquisitor wants that. What about what we want? What did you do? Come on, out with it. Out. My si Just. I think he looks sick. He looks sick to me. He's tossed in like Never been the same since, has he? Not for a date. He's a dumb madman, I tell you. Thank oh, I thought then you oh. hey yeah people hand up short abs then Garth short time for a little lesson Ah huh? This is getting better! Ah! Yeah! 
The guards are here to protect you. There'll be trouble and a few now. Coins for me. I'm sure. I'm sure you have things to deal with. Now, would you rather walk away or crawl? Hang around here, and the choice won't be yours. If you don't want to do this the easy way, I'm happy to do it the hard way. I don't do easy ways. Time for a little lesson. Is that all yeah. you've got? Yeah. Huh? Yes! This is good stuff. Is that all you've got? This is good stuff. We need more like this. Great. This is good stuff. Yes. Yes. Ah, is that all you've got? That wasn't half bad. That was fun. Oh, that does not feel good. Now start talking. Look, I didn't mean to step on the Don's toes. You stole his weed. That's pretty much stomping on them. I... I wasn't going to sell it in Harbour Town. Then where? Just, uh, just in the monastery. They all love a bit of Bruegel up there. You should remember it's the Don's Bruegel. They're rich up there. Loads of gold. It's all that poking around in the ruins. Who else is involved in this Bruegel smuggling? Just me. And I'm supposed to believe that? Believe what you like. Haven't you got nothing better to do? Right. Now, let's hear the truth. It's Cutter's fault. He made me do it. He did, he did. He wanted me to set aside some weed for him. Just a bit. What did he give you for it? Me. And some gold. But it wasn't much. And I haven't any left. Please don't tell Carlos. I couldn't hack it in the monastery. I'm not cut out for it. I have allergies. Just get out of here. Thanks.
These packages may interest you. What's this? My, oh my. That is a lot of Bruegel weed. The packages are weasels. You wanted proof? This should be enough. This is more than enough. So he'll be sent to the monastery? Weasel as a recruit? Every man would have to watch their back. No, it's enough if he leaves town. Let him crawl back to the swamp. You found the evidence. I hope you can be counted on to make sure he leaves. Marcelo has got the packages. What? The Don's gonna be pissed off about this. Really pissed off. Leave the town. You get one chance. This is my town. Our town. You'll never be rid of us. We'll be back. Down the weapon. <laughs> ah, good thing you're here. I've been hearing rumors, but I want the news straight from you. I retrieved the three golden bowls for Carrasco. That's good. They shall be processed and sent to the monastery. Well done. Here is your reward. About the Don's followers. Luca was trying to smuggle artifacts from the town. I stopped him. Luca, can't these people see we have to work together to survive? It was a pity there was a need for this, but that doesn't stop it being a job well done. About the Don's followers. Weasel was responsible for the Bruegel weed trade in the merchant district and through the town. I've put a stop to that. That man was extremely brazen. It is a good thing to be rid of him. Here is your reward. About the Don's followers. Tony won't cause any more trouble, but he did try to break into the Don's old house. Aha. Uh -huh. Then he should be glad I didn't catch him there. Well done. Here is your reward. The town is now free of the Don's men. I heard. Every one of the Don's men gone from the streets. This town and the Order owe you a debt. All that is missing is the leader of this gang. If you were to see to it that Scordo disappeared, that would be an immeasurable service to the people of this island. We've disrupted the Don's plans. The town should be safe for now. Yes. We certainly have less to deal with now, and weakening the Don strengthens us. It is only a question of time until the Don finally abandons his plans altogether. Now it is time that we dealt with the artifact smuggling. I must know how the artifacts are leaving the town without being found. I will stop the artifact smugglers. Good. I have heard rumors that the brothel on the Harbor Key is connected with the smuggling. But I can't imagine Sonya is behind this racket. If you were to find proof of who is, we could finally arrest the smugglers.
Tony's going to leave. Good. That'll save me having to stare at him all day. Here's some gold to line your pocket. You should think about getting some training in the monastery. We could use a man like you. About this treasure seeker. The business with Carrasco and the Golden Bowls has been dealt with. You can let the prisoner go. Oh, is that so? I found the three Golden Bowls and gave them to Carrasco. Are you sure? Absolutely. Well, I suppose there's no point in wasting food on Ulf then. We've more to be worried about than some bowls. Wait here, I'll get him. Hey, send the prisoner out here. The Inquisition is letting you go. Nice work. Can't say I'm sad to be leaving this dingy hole. One hole to another, though. How do we get out of this town? I'll go down to the Harbor Quay and find my brothers. Once you can get us out of town, come and find us. But make sure the way is really clear, okay? We're not too fond of being led into traps. Catch you later. I'm sure you've got things to do. Okay, sell me the ring. Believe me, you're getting one good deal right there. Don't let Carlos or his people catch you with it, though. So, you'll buy the fish stall? Yeah. Fish from the shore in the mornings, sell during the day. Gotta be better than what I'm doing right now. Phyllis will be happy to hear that. Show me your fish. You actually want to buy some? Well, don't forget, it's two for one. Let me have some place. Here, two place. 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 Give me a shark steak. Here, one steak and another for the road. I found someone. Nico will buy your stall. What? Is he crazy? Oh well, his craziness, my escape. Thank you for finding him. Here, I found this clam in a fish crate. Might be of use to you. Now you're fish free, what will you do now? I'm going to Patty's. I'll get the gold from Nico on the way, and then I'm going to get very, very drunk. What fish do you have for trade?
do need information. I'm all ears. What is the situation like in town? Esteban's men are pretty quiet. Maybe they're plotting something. But if they don't act soon, I suppose that means the Inquisition is here to stay. I need to know something. Who's responsible for the artifact smuggling in this town? Well, I think you've got enough of a reputation that I can trust you. So listen up. In the storeroom behind our washroom is Scordo, one of Esteban's men. The picture on the wall in the washroom hides a secret switch. It opens the door to Scordo's hideout. No idea what he does in there all day, but I know he's guarding something. And it's behind that door at the end of the passage. He always has the key on him. You want to know what he's up to? If I were you, sweetie, that's the first place I'd look. So how do you know about this door, if it's such a secret? Oh, you know, most men are pretty easy to read. Hit the right spot with them and they'll sing like birdies. <laughs> Scordo told me himself, with a little, um, persuasion. Thanks for the information. Anytime. Like I said, there's not much I don't get to hear about, one way or another. What are you doing here? What do you want? I came to see if you have any casual work. Work? I can get my hands on enough workers if I need them. I'll take your gold, though, if there's something you'd like to buy while you're here. What are you selling? Antiques. Golden ones. Things brought in by the refugees. All legit. I have provenance for all of them. Let's trade. And where do these antiques come from? Inheritances. Grandmother's mantelpieces and farmer's hideaways. A man gets caught selling anything illegal, trading artifacts, he gets in trouble. I deal in antiques. Where does that passage over there lead to? That? That's no passage. That's a storeroom. And you're going to stay away from it. Because it's my business. Why are you back here in a storeroom? Dangerous times. Lots of thieves. Man needs security. You're hiding. Hiding from whom? There's a world of difference between hiding and being discreet. So what brings a man like you into a storeroom? There you go again. Blunt you are. I'm a man trying to make a living in difficult times. Times when creatures would take your life off you, and your fellow man would strip you of your pride. And what's a man without pride? This is why you don't like the Inquisition being here. The Don knows pride. I'm talking about years of injustice, years of faceless men, Names on paper from the mainland deciding our fate. I'm talking about using events to escape the chains they've been keeping us in. People think it's just about surviving. But what's the point of having a life if you spend it paying taxes, working to the bone for others to live in gold and silk? A man needs pride. I'm thinking you must be that castaway. I've heard you've been helpful. Helpful... To the Inquisitor, that is. What makes you say that? Oh, you know what it's like. Word gets around. And you do seem to be everywhere, collaborating, doing his good works. Good for him, that is. And his good seems to be leaving others starving, doesn't it? All right, Scordo. I know you've been smuggling artifacts out of the town. Do you now? You know all artifacts are supposed to be handed to the Order. You know, I think you're right. I found this sword in the ruins. So we fight.
See what we can find. And I'm happy to give it to the order. Blade first. So we fight. Ah. See what we can find. And I'm happy to give it to the order. Blade first. So we fight. Ah! to achieve. And I'm happy to give it to the order. Blade first. So we fight. Ah. what we can find. And I'm happy to give it to the order. Blade first. So we fight. Huh? Yeah! Yeah! Huh? Yeah. 
Gordo. What? Thought you'd kill me? You're not the first who've tried. I don't die easy. Don't bother me with this. Now who could teach me to pick locks? You know Captain Steelbeard? Yeah, but I wish I didn't. I should never have got involved with him. Promised he was going to take me away from all this. Promised me the moon and the stars. Some men will say anything for a free fuck. And all I got was a whole heap of trouble. So don't go saying that name around me, because I ain't listening no more. I can't help you anymore. About the Don's followers. Scordo, the leader of the Don's men, had this key on him. Hmm. That looks like a key to the sewers. They must be smuggling artifacts out through this tunnel. The idiots. Damned idiots. These thieves don't realize what they're doing. I don't want to think about what has slipped through our fingers. The knowledge we've lost. Well, at least we have the key now. Here, a reward. You earned it. Finally, we can arrest these artifact smugglers. Go, seize the man responsible for this. I want Scordo finished. I want him pondering his misdeeds behind the walls of the monastery. Just stand around. Be off with you. Commandant Carlos knows where you're hiding. Go to the monastery, or he will have you hung out for the crows. You think the monastery will break me, do you? There's nothing the Inquisitor can take from me. He's not already taken a thousand times. Then maybe you should take what he's offering, instead of fighting him. Not with my last breath. Big talk. Just make sure you make your way to the monastery. They've tried ruling this island for years. They've never broken us. And they never will.
Hey, you! I've got orders from Carlos to send you to the guardhouse. Get going! Ah, good thing you're here. I've been hearing rumors, but I want the news straight from you. About the Don's followers. Scordo will no longer trouble this town. You have surpassed yourself. With Scordo gone, we can all breathe more easily. You have done us a very great service. If I can do anything for you, name it. Would you help me get training at the monastery? I think you are ready now, young man. I will give you my recommendation if you wish. Master Belshaw has given me his blessing. Indeed. Master Belshaw thinks much of you. So, take this recommendation from me. You have earned it. The warriors of the Order will allow you through. Now you have my permission. Go to the monastery. There, you will be asked if you will choose the path of magic or the path to become a warrior of the Order. You choose your own fate. So choose wisely. I wish you good luck. I don't feel like talking. About you escaping town. I told your brothers to come here. Thanks. I appreciate that. Now all three of you are here, you can leave town. Just tell us how, and we're out of here. There's a secret tunnel in the back storeroom of Madame Sonia's brothel. It leads right out of town. Right. We'll meet in the storeroom. Then you can show us this tunnel. See you there. The map done. I've come for the map. And I've finished it. If you want it, pay me and it's yours. Yes, I'll take it. Take good care of it. Maps are works of art. Let's trade.
Let me see your goods. Who could teach me to pick locks? Never mind. not touch anything here. Here. I brought you your bow. You got it back for me? Why did you do that? A hunter needs a bow. Take it. Thank you. But there's nothing I can... I have nothing. It's all right. Well? What do you want? You've got what you wanted, now leave me alone. There's a way out of town through the storeroom of Madame Sonia's brothel. Really? Wouldn't have thought that that witless sop would have the guts. She's a woman who likes to keep the bed warm on both sides of the argument. Still, you have the ring of truth, and I haven't had any better leads. I'll meet you at Sonia's. You can show me this tunnel before you can think of any reward. About you escaping town. I've checked it. The path through the tunnel is clear. Okay, let's check it out, boys. Once we get outside, we'll probably make camp on the beach outside the town's walls. So, if you're in the market for treasure seekers, you'll know where to find us. On the beach, right? We'll hit the road now. Good luck with whatever it is you're up to on this island. Right, so let's see this tunnel. I've checked. The way out of the tunnel is clear. It leads outside the town walls. I'm impressed. And not a question of a reward, yet. I don't have cause to say this often, but thank you. I promise, once I've found what I'm looking for, I'll return the favor. 
I'm going to head for the beach outside the town, see what I can find. Got to start somewhere. I'll be there for a little while. Just in case you get the urge to look for me. I don't know anymore. I thought you'd like to know. Patty has left town. I bet she's meeting with her father. Appreciate the information. Here, take this. Perhaps now I can find out what that seaburn bastard is plotting. I've got nothing more to say to you. <laughs> 